In this video, I want to show you how to solve question 12 of chapter 5. Determine the horizontal and vertical components of reaction at the pin A and the reaction of the rocker B on the beam. Let's start with a free body diagram. At pin A, we have a revolute joint with two forces, AX and AY. At rocker B, we have a roller joint and a force perpendicular to the surface of contact. Writing the moment equation around pin A, assuming the counterclockwise direction is positive. Force 4 creates a clockwise moment about A, so it's negative, minus 4 times the distance 6. We then have to project force B into its vertical and horizontal components. When this angle is 30 degrees, this angle is also 30 degrees, hence this would be 60 degrees. The horizontal component is B cosine 60 and the vertical component is B sine 60. Because force B cosine 60 passes through pin A, it doesn't make any moment about A. But the other force, B sine 60 makes a counterclockwise moment about A, so its moment is positive B sine 60 times 8. From here, we can find force B, which is 3.46 kN. And from sigma Fx positive to the right equal to 0, we can write Ax minus B cosine 60 which is 3.46 cosine 60. From here we can find Ax, which is 1.73 kN. And from sigma Fy positive upward equal to 0, we can write Ay plus B sine 60, which is 3.46 sine 60, minus the 4 kN force, equal to 0. From here we have Ay, which is 1 kN. We found positive values for Ax and Ay which mean the initially assumed directions for Ax and Ay are correct, and Ax is to the right and Ay is upward, and B is perpendicular to the shown surface. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe to us, share this content with your friends, and don't hesitate to ask your questions in the comments.